Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Hi Sagittarius 5 sign. Today I am going to do general reading. May or may not resonate everyone. So take what resonates and leave the rest. If you like my content, please do like the video guys. Then it will reach more people. And thank you so much for supporting me. If anyone wants a personal reading, comment me in comment box and it is chargeable. So let's see your messages Sagittarius 5 sign, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. First we will see general messages regarding your career and finances. Thank you for all your messages. Right now I'm little bit okay. <laughs> I'm recovering. Thank you so much. So let's see your messages. So recent past, your present and future. And your present energy, death card with six of wands. So I want to clarify death card. Right now you are suffering Sagittarius. You are going through something emotionally in your life. Five of Cups with Death card. Definitely some of you are going through some uh, transformation also. For some it could be minor. For some it could be major one. But you are in so much pain. At the same time you are going through some transformation. Recently something came to end in your life unexpectedly. <clears throat> Maybe it is regarding to your career or personal also. But you are focusing on your career because you want success in your life. So even though you are feeling emotionally low, you are really focusing on your career. So yeah. And three of cups, you want to celebrate your success. I think you accepted the reality here. So recent past, six of swords with knight of pentacles. In recent past, you did a lot of hard work because Knight of Pentacles. But things moved very, very slowly. But consistently, you did your work. And Six of Swords means maybe some of you, you travel to other uh, city or country or you migrated to other city or country regarding your work or regarding your job purpose. And present 10 of pentacles with high priestess. But right now I'm seeing a lot of financial stability, a lot of money growth here. Because 10 of pentacles and high priestess, you are uh, watching tarot card read uh, readings a lot in these recent times. Or you want to learn also. And yes, right now you are trying to listen to your intuition and trusting your inner voice. At the same time, you are hiding something from some something from your people. You don't want to reveal something. Expression regarding your finances and future the world with five of wands. In future, you need to take care of yourself. Uh, there will be some competition involved, five of wands. Maybe some people are bad mouthing about you. So take care of yourself. Don't involve in any unnecessary uh, arguments. And the world you are trying to find, uh, your place in this world as a very successful person. So let's see messages for you regarding your career and finances. The moon and queen of wands and nine of cups.
so yes you need to trust your inner voice and follow your intuition and queen of wands means focus on yourself focus on your passion invest energy on yourself and major wish fulfillment very soon your wish is going to be granted sagittarius i am seeing wish fulfillment here nine of cups so let's see love messages So your person current thoughts and your current thoughts your person present energy and your present energy under the deck seven of wands so your person is feeling heartbroken and you are feeling that you are overly obsessing over your person you obsessively thinking about your person some of you are dealing with gemini libra aquarius or capricorn virgo taurus especially capricorn so definitely your person is not happy right now they are feeling heartbroken here or they feeling hurt but this spying you on social media they want to communicate with you or right now they are communicating and wheel of fortune but your person is waiting for the change here and right now i'm seeing some defensive energy between both of you guys seven of wands energy and your current feelings or thoughts nine of cups five of pentacles and two of swords so right now you're feeling that your person is not giving enough attention to you you are feeling that they ghosting you they neglecting you so you are at some crossroads yes you wishing for this connection because nine of cups is here but uh, the devil you know this person is toxic at the same time you are very addicted to this person emotionally so that's why it is very difficult for you to cut this bond to cut this tie so that's why you are at some crossroads so you don't know which one which one you have to do whether you have to stay or whether you have to walk away from this relationship so let's see your person next action Seven of Cups under the deck. Five of Wands, Death card, and Eight of Pentacles. So Sagittarius, uh, you person <clears throat> also going through some transformation. See, you both are on the same page. Yes, they are in some confusion. They are also going through some inner conflict here, but they want to work on this relationship. So, see, even though they are in some confusion, they do want you. But they are in so much confusion. I want to clarify that card. Yes, they have some fears. And they want to work on this relationship. So let's see what is the near future outcome of this relationship. And where this relationship is. Mm -hmm. Under the deck 2 of Pentacles. Three of Cups, Page of Cups, and the Star. Some of you are dealing with Aquarius A sign. So I am seeing apology. Definitely, I am seeing apology. So <laughs> again, I am seeing never-ending story here. 
definitely they will come back again even though if you both are in separation or there is some communication gap i am seeing they are coming and you both wishing for this connection i am seeing communication so three of cups definitely they want to take this relationship to next level and you both want stability in this relationship so let's say energy oracle messages angel of love love yourself for sagittarius self love is very very important and your angels has your back hostility is you are getting the same card again and again so you need to work on yourself lots of you you are not feeling well you are not grow, uh, you are not feeling grounded uh, so you need to work on yourself surrender to the divine so if you if you are not getting solutions to your problem just surrender to the divine or the universe look at the bigger picture full moon in sagittarius and take time to breathe out if you are doing consistent work the message here is you need to take rest and look at the bigger picture so think so try to see things in a different way so this is the reading for you guys hope it resonate to you please do share like and subscribe my channel and click the bell icon then you will get all my video notification thank you so much for watching and supporting me please do like the video guys thank you